If you're watching this video, it means that you might need a little bit of help on the defensive side of the ball in Madden 22. What's going on guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel focuses in on helping people become the best Madden player they could possibly become. So if you're looking to get better at this game, click subscribe, turn on those notifications as we upload videos every single day that can help you become a better player. And like I said, if you're watching this video, chances are you're like me and you're finding that in Madden 22, defense is really, really, really hard to have consistent. And so I want to give you a little money defense that I like to use out of the nickel triple. This is my favorite defense, at least at this point in the season. Um, it's very good with pressure. The interesting thing is this is also a really good run defense. And it's also got some decent coverage schemes that you can run out of this. So nickel triple, we're in the Chicago Bears playbook, I believe. This, I think, can also be found in the Baltimore playbook, as well as a couple of others. But the nickel triple is one of the better blitzing formations in this year's game. And so I'm just going to come out in a base cover three and give you uh, some pressure packages. But before I get into the pressure, um, I wanted to let you know about my text message membership. What my text message membership is, is it is a way that you can get free Madden 22 ebooks all season long. And it's again, completely free to you. There's no subscription. There's no monthly charge. There's no nothing. All you have to do to get it is text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. Again, that's text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. And every single week of the Madden 22 season, we are gonna be releasing a free offense and defensive guide for you to be able to dominate on the sticks. These guides are gonna be very similar to what I do in eBooks, and they're gonna be about an hour long. So if you wanna get access to that, again, text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. Okay guys, so I wanted to go over the single triple and um, really simple here. All we're gonna do is we're just going to pinch our defensive line, okay? And we're just gonna press coverage, that's it. And what you're gonna see here is we're gonna use our Levante Dave. That's gonna be our primary user on this uh, defense. And we're gonna put our, we're gonna basically blitz all of our linebackers and then just simply crash our line out, just like that. And we're gonna stand kind of right in here. And all we're gonna do is we're just gonna kind of run down a little bit and then we're gonna jump into coverage. And what you're gonna see here is we're gonna get really, really fast pressure off that left edge. This is really my favorite, it's, it's one of my favorite blitzes. There's a lot of good blitzes this year. This one's really easy to set up. Again, all we're doing, and if you wanted to, you could do this very simply. All you gotta do is just pinch your defense and globally blitz your linebackers. That's it. That's the only adjustment we're gonna do. And I want you to watch here, snap the ball. You're gonna see we're still gonna scream right at the quarterback. So real simple, just pinch your defense, blitz all your linebackers, and you're just gonna user the linebacker that's backed off, and you're gonna put him kind of right over here on this left guard, snap the ball. And as you see, we're getting very consistent pressure. Now, I wanna talk a little bit briefly here about a way that we can actually make this blitz a little bit better. The first thing that I like to do with this, uh, whenever I run this blitz, is I actually really like to go ahead and play hard flats. But what I like to do on this left side, um, because I know that you know the, the table route is so good and there's really not a great way for this hard flat to do anything that I necessarily needed to do, what I'll typically do is put that as a hook curl and I'm gonna play the left side flat myself. That's just kind of my mentality um, and how I like to play it this year, okay? If you really wanted to, you could play more of a cover two approach. So you could do something like that um, if you wanted to. But again, snap the ball and just watch the pressure just completely screen. Okay? So that's the basic blitz. And then as far as uh, other things we can do to basically make this a little bit better is we could actually place uh, put some people in coverage. So uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to drop this uh, I'm gonna go ahead and play those hard flats again. And I'm gonna take the X player and I'm actually gonna put him into a bluff blitz assignment, which is gonna put him into the hook curl or the three rec hook zone. And what you'll see here is that when I run down, I'm still gonna get pretty decent pressure right off that edge for an instant sack, okay? It's just as simple. All I'm doing is putting him in the three rec hook zone. And when I do that, I like to actually uh, I really like to be a little bit more on this shadow to the right just to kind of help the pressure a little bit. So I'm just going to run down and you're going to see here that time the pressure got picked up. But 
we've got a little bit of a chance. The other thing, the other way that you could do this is you could drop the nose tackle just like that, okay? So I dropped the nose tackle into a three red hook zone. I'm still blitzing off the edge. And watch the pressure. You're going to see that time we got picked up, but you got a little bit better coverage as a result, okay? So that's a little bit about how you can, you can kind of finagle the pressure a little bit. Um, another way that I like to send heat this year is I really like the idea of overloading. So I'm going to crash my line here to the left. And let me just show you my crash mat line to the, to the left there, just like that. And then I'm going to run that same concept of the bluff blitz, snap the ball. And you'll see here that time the defensive tackle couldn't get quite as far as I wanted him to, but you know, we still get pretty decent pressure. So, you know, you can kind of drop some people into coverage out of this. The one thing I would say, though, is, you know, you, if you take a look at these blitz angles, it's really important to understand the blitz angle. The more you understand the blitz angle, the more you'll understand about the blitz and where to stand. So you'll see right here, if I stand left, you see the pressure completely scream off the left edge. Now, one little other trick uh, with this would be to go ahead and simply spread your defensive line. Uh, what you're going to see is we're going to run the same concept but this time you're gonna see here that we've spread our defensive line. And let me see if I can get back on Levante David here. And what you'll see is we're still gonna scream off the edge, okay? So you can run it from two different looks from there. The other thing that I like about this is I'm gonna show you another pressure. Uh, this one is a little bit, a uh, little bit, in my opinion, uh, not as good against three by one type sets. But what we can do is we can basically take this, um, this guy right here, Pierre Paul, and we can essentially drop him into a hard flat to take away those table routes. This is where I actually do like to go ahead and play some cover two. Um, so I'm gonna play cover two on the right. And then on this left side, really what I'm doing is I'm in the middle of the field. Uh, my job is the middle of the field. You're gonna see here, you know, you're gonna, it's gonna really come more into that like cover three uh, cloud type of coverage. But what you'll see here is that slot corner that time I got kind of glitched out, but that slot corner should come right off the edge. Let me show that to you one more time. So again, all we're going to do is we're going to globally blitz the linebackers, just like we've been doing. We're going to pinch our defensive line and we're going, or we're going to pinch our defense basically. Okay. And then we're going to crash our defensive line out and we're going to drop that backside guy into a hard flat. Okay. Just like that. And then we're going to blitz that slot corner. Now, if you wanted to, you can go ahead and do the contain rush off the edge. It's gonna get them a little wider, but take a look at that contain rush, rushing right in off the outside. So that's, you know, sending five, getting two, or getting one free. And then for the last piece of this defense, uh, what you can also do is you can basically just send both sides. This is where I really recommend, um, you know, being in a situation where you could maybe go into something like a hard flat cover two style defense on that bunch side and really if the running back goes out you're going to go guard him but this way if the running back stays in you're going to see that you're going to absolutely scream off the edge at the quarterback i want to thank you for watching this video i hope this video is kind of the start of helping you guys build your defenses and some of your blitzing concepts the nickel triple is one of the best defenses again this year it's a really good pressure defense. There's a lot more that I can go into that I'm not going to go into in this video. But this defense, mark my words, is going to be one of the best defenses all season long. Now, if you want to, again, if you want to sign up and you want to get my Madden 22 offensive and defensive schemes sent to your cell phone completely for free, all you have to do is text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And be sure that you're subscribed to the channel so you know whenever we go live. We typically stream every single day uh, at 5 o'clock p.m. Mountain Time, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. So make sure you're subscribed. And again, if you want to get those free schemes, text the word Madden to 208-218-6900.